Hey guys, Red Panda Mining here. Today guys, I want to talk to you guys about Grin and why I'm not going to be mining Grin. Um, I just I just found out today, lots of news, I've been reading a whole bunch of stuff. But uh, take it as you will, do what you'd like, make sure you guys research. This is not financial advice, all that good stuff. Okay guys, so before I start, Grin, the private and lightweight Mimble Wimble blockchain. So, just to give you guys some backstory of what Grin is, it's just a, it's basically Zcash, <laughs> and uh, so pr it's private, scalable, open. Uh, Mimblewimble leverages cryptography to allow the most of the past transaction data to be removed. This guarantees guarantees Grin won't collapse under its own weight in the long term. Uh, Grin has no amounts. To, no amounts and no addresses. Transactions can be trivially aggregated to hide where a newly created transaction comes from. I, yeah, I mean, it, it sounds good, guys. It sounds good, but in terms of in terms of mining and all that good stuff, I uh, I, I don't think I don't think it's great for a number of reasons, uh, which I'm gonna show you guys right now. Uh, so. It's just just one of the big things I, I really don't like first is the uh, there's an ASIC for it already announced launching with it uh, the obelisk GRN1 launches a new generation grin ASIC mining system via Kakatu 31 algorithms so if you guys don't know Kakatu is the mining algorithm for grin and also there's Kakatu 29 for the lower for the GPU lower GPUs with less memory so another thing, as you can see here, guys, I these pools, F2 pool, Spark pool, you know, these these are all these are all Chinese pools. Like, look look how much hash power is on these. A any pool that I see like top three, top four Chinese pools on, I I consider it, I consider it kind of a scam, and possibly a scam. I I don't know I. <sighs> When you see a lot of Chinese people mine to a certain one, it could be just like a couple guys with huge ass farms and they're planning on just manipulating or selling the coin later on or after they mine a whole bunch, right? Uh, but as you can see, like, Grin, value drops 98% in its first day of trading. Here is why. So th those kind of things, I, I feel like no one can really explain that except for Okay, let's let's see what he says here. New privacy-oriented cryptocurrency Grin has just recently gone live with a high price of $261 per coin after its first block was mined. However, in sub subsequent 24 hours, the coin lost as much as 98% of its value and currently trades around $7.50 uh, $7 due to its expansion of its coin supply. So, there's a monetary policy that I was reading about why this this grin is is bound to fail in the future because there's no cap on the coin to mine it's 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 just going to keep you can mine as much as as you can uh, everyone can just keep mining there's no stop to it right um uh so th there's this uh, post on reddit the um grin price is un unsustainable i see people fiercely defending this as if it's obvious but is it really? After one year, there will be 31,536,000 grin at the current price of $6.43, CoinGecko. Okay, so less now than the, the article that we, ha we had here on uh, Crypto Potato. That would put the market cap at 202,776,480. A little bit more than Bitcoin SV, Tron, Litecoin, or Stellar. And little less than EOS or Bitcoin Cash. That seems like a reasonable expectation to me, especially if you consider that the overall overall market cap overall market might go up. Longer term, here how here's how the supply will behave after that. So it shows here, you know, one year, three million, second year, uh, thirty one million, sorry, uh, sixty three million, ninety four million, year three, inflation. So. So he explains down here, so to break even, Grin will will need to double in market cap year two, gain 50% more in year three, and so on. That also seems reasonable to expect. Okay. 
So it depends, you guys. If if are you guys in it for the technology or are you in it for the money, the monetary <laughs> benefit? So here's here's what I'm here's what I'm thinking. Here's what I'm here's what I'm thinking. Oh yeah, here's here's the one thing before I continue. I'll show you guys this. Look at this. This is a Twitter post from Evan Ryer, Crypto Even, Crypto Evan, uh, prepping for Grin mainnet mainnet launch today. Look at this. Look at this guy's farm. He's just tons of of GPUs. Look at that. Mining, mining for Grin. So, as you can see for the Grin pools, you know, uh, Grin C29, C32, C31. Uh, Look at this, look at the Chinese pool. It's like massive. 46.8% of the pool's hash reach. 505 hash. So how many miners are on here? It doesn't show how many miners are on this pool, but Grin Mint, there's 1700 and 1765, 1765 miners on this pool. Uh, on the Germany pool, there's 1578. Uh, if, if we go if we go to Grin C29, yeah, we got a lot. <laughs> Why is there no miner showing on the Chinese pool here? That's weird. F2 pool. Huh. 50% 50, 50 of the pool's hash rate in China right now to the Chinese pool. I mean, who knows? Like, yeah, I mean, could the hash rate could be coming from anywhere, right? Who knows? I... Uh, Let's continue, guys. So, as you know, the obelisk was announced. I mentioned earlier uh, in this video. So, I'm going to go to the Medium article. I'm just going to go all the way down. Just skip all this stuff. They're just talking about, you know, the algorithm, whatnot. You guys most, you guys probably know already. Their sales structure, specifications, all that good stuff. Uh, but the conclusion is what I wanted to say is... Here it is. It, it is our goal to see that Grin is secure against 51% attacks and censorship attacks, both because hash rate is decentralized and also because the incentives of all the hardware owners are aligned with protecting Grin as opposed to attacking it. We believe that Grin has a good foundation to achieve these goals, and we are excited to be manufacturing an ASIC that has the potential to be a force of good for Grin for the Grin community. Uh, ASICs, 51% attacks, secure, censorship attacks. Is it really? Is it really, guys? Is it? Uh, I don't know. I, they announced... Okay, a, another thing that's fishy to me is that when Grin was announced, this, this ASIC was announced literally a day after. It, or during yeah a day after so it's just fishy to me guys like why why mine this coin why expect this like uh, is it gonna be like uh, like another like sia coin all over again or um a garlic coin you guys know the hype of garlic coin and like oh man they had 108k subscribers on reddit it was such a meme guys like i'm not saying grin is a meme but like there's other coins out there that that's like way better right now like sure they speak of all this stuff you know it seems awesome and the hype right but is it really guys is it really like <sighs> I, I i don't know i can't I, it's really hard for me to trust these new coins right now like let, let me know let me know what you guys think i i'm i'm i'm, I'm really skeptic skepticism you know skeptic of this of this coin I know a lot of other miners are, are mining this right now. They've made Voscoin made a tutorial about it. Um, Seth Estrada, I believe, one made one. Uh, but I, I'm playing the the uh, skepticism card right now. I, I I don't know if I can I can I don't know if I can go for another coin right now. I don't know how Grin could um, be that coin, right? Like. It's obviously so hyped because it's new and it's like it's, it's a new algorithm, right? The new Wimble, 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 Wimble something, Cockatoo 29, Cockatoo 31 algorithm. Like, I know it sounds exciting, but 
man, in the long run, is it? There's no, there's no cap, and uh, it's um, a grin every every second, I believe. Transaction, uh, block. I mean, uh, I think I read that. If I read that right, but um, uh, here's one of the top comments. Grin was a good idea until this garbage monetary policy ruined it. IMO. There will be no reason to own this coin, unlike until like 20, 30 years down the line, because it will be inflated so much that it relies on the price rising, rising based off speculation. That's the word, guys. This is this is the coin, speculation, right? Same with garlic coins. Same with a whole bunch of other coins. It's, all the coins, speculation, right, guys? Like. What is cryptocurrency? Your cryptocurrency, why do you invest in cryptocurrency? Because of the speculation. You're hoping the, the price will go up, right? Are you in it for the tech? Yeah, maybe you are. Maybe most of you are, some of you are, but most people are in it for the monetary gambling value of it going up, right? Want to make money, right? I'm one of those people. So, I <laughs> I mean, I like the tech too. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of both. I'm kind of like in the middle, so... I'm 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 really I'm passionate about cryptocurrency. I'm passionate about mining specifically. Um, so yeah, like, you tell me what you guys think down in the comments. Tell me what you guys think about Grin. <sighs> but yeah, that's all I wanted to get at, guys. Um, I'll have these linked in the description. All these articles and stuff, the pools and stuff. Uh, I had some other articles here. I'm not I'm not gonna get into, but. Uh, yeah, guys, let me let me know what you guys think. Let me go. Let me know what you guys think about Grin. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a good one.